I've always wanted the chance to have fun with a centaur guy. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh! Your muscles are quite impressive, by the way. Would you mind taking off your shirt for a moment? Well, if you think it's a good idea, here you go. And thanks for the compliment. Thanks for your understanding. I appreciate your dedication to your work. You're welcome. I'm always here to take care of the horses. All right, got him to take his shirt off. Oh, I don't know how to say this, but I've realized that my heart belongs to Peter. He's the one who truly captures my affection. He is smitten. Never doubt the power of a shirtless twonk. So is his name Jaime? Ahoy, Lancelot. Greetings from the mystical realm of unexpected visits. Uh, hello, who are you? I am Jaime, the magnificent sorcerer from the kingdom. Oh, I just saw what's going on in the background. I am Jaime, the magnificent sorcerer from the kingdom of Pantheron. Your father, Bon, sent me to lend you a hand. Well, more like a magical helping wand. But you get the idea. My father, Ban, the one who poisoned Uther, stole Excalibur, kidnapped the prince, and got killed, right? My father sent you? Why? Oh, just a little magical emergency he had to attend to. He thought, why not send Jaime to spice up Lancelot's life a little bit? And here I am. Spice up my life? Yes, like adding a dash of enchantment, a sprinkle of adventure, and a pinch of whimsy. You know, the good stuff. And I know you believe your dad didn't do those wicked things. Let's clear his name, shall we? I have no idea what you're talking about. Perfect! That's the spirit. Now let's embark on a magical journey together. You'll thank me later. I highly doubt that. Hi, me. Jamie? Uh, is it Jamie? <laughs> I might be a bit ignorant. I've just never seen... Or maybe it's very rare that I've seen Jamie. I'll call him Jamie until someone corrects me. Hello, Lancelot. You can press F1 for menu, and the menu, you can save, load... You can save the game, load the game, equip weapons, and use items and more. Thank you for giving me money to buy medicine for Mary. The little girl is feeling so much better now. You're the best man in the city of Camelot. Don't venture into the forest without an antidote necklace and a sword. If you're not strong enough, stay near the unicorns for a timely healing. You should also avoid entering the graveyard, as the demons there are even stronger than the monsters in the forest. Only go there when you have fully explored the forest. An author is hunting you down. This time, he has many soldiers. It's best if you have an honorable sword, Lance. A wooden stick won't, do, won't be very useful this time. Whether you go into the town or the forest, you should have a sword with you. Earlier, I saw something very interesting under the bridge. You should take a look. <laughs> oh, I know what he saw. I know what he saw. He saw this man over here. I gotta go medal for watching that man do stuff to himself. Lancelot, Arthur is hunting for you. You need to get out of here, now. The only safe place is the forest. Hide there and don't come out until I tell you it's safe. Okay, let's sell some stuff. So they said I won't be able to use this wooden stick. So let's sell it. And they said a poison charm. We're gonna need a poison charm. Let's get two, since we have two people in our party. And a sword. Okay. Unicorn. Hmm. Wow, the cakes look really tempting. I can make some money selling them. Let's swipe those cakes, shall we? 
Mr. Baker, noticing Lancelot. Hey there, what do you think you're doing? Well, I guess we can't swipe the cakes while he's watching us. my friend the weather is scorching hot today isn't it indeed it is my horse and I are feeling the heat I can see your muscles have really bulked up since the last time we met well I've been working hard to keep up with the demands of this job your muscles are quite impressive by the way would you mind taking off your shirt for a moment well if you think it's a good idea here you go and thanks for the compliment Thanks for your understanding. I appreciate your dedication to your work. You're welcome. I'm always here to take care of the horses. All right, got him to take his shirt off. Oh, when I see Peter, the stable boy, I always feel something special. I think I've fallen for him. You know, every time I see Peter with those magnificent horses, I can't help but admire him. I don't know how to say this, but I've realized that my heart belongs to Peter. He's the one who truly captures my affection. He is smitten. Never doubt the power of a shirtless twonk. Now that he's distracted by a shirtless sweaty Peter, I'll just take this bread and cheese. Well, well, it seems our stable boy is as impressive as his steeds. Mm-mm-mm. You pervert. So we have what they said we need. Let's go into the woods. Awesome on my neck. Sweat drips, nothing left. It's a map. Hello, traveler. This is the Grail Forest, a quite large and beautiful forest. Due to the high number of people getting lost in the forest, the town hall has commissioned a map. You should take a good look at it before venturing deep into the woods. I'll give you a secret to avoid getting lost. Use the sun for orientation. If you walk towards the sun, you'll reach Grailwood Village. And conversely, walking away from the sun will lead you back to Camelot Town. Always stick to the main trail. If you find yourself deeply lost in the forest, just walk in the opposite direction of the sun and you'll make your way back to Camelot. Monsters in the forest are plentiful, so it's best to ensure you're equipped with a proper sword and antidote necklace before venturing further. Good luck. Help over here in the ruins. Help, I'm hurt. All right. Oh my goodness, there's a dragon over there. Help, somebody please help. I'm gonna try to avoid this dragon, all right? I think it might be too strong for us. Oh, yeah, it's too strong for us. Oh, it's gone, though. Oh, we have fully restored our vitality. Oh, who, what's wrong with you? Ugh. Indeed, the only person in the world I don't want to see. Hi, Lance. What kind of fashion is this? Oh, my God. The gods really know how to tease humans, don't they, Kay? Why are you lying here feeling sleepy, huh? I've been bitten by an a I've been bitten by an Anadraga. The poison is acting up. Please find the centaurs. They know how to make an antidote. Come on, man, we've grown up together. Lance, 
you, me, and Arthur and the boys. So, Arthur, your beloved cousin and perfect prince, where is he? Why not ask him to help? I've treated you poorly recently, Lance, but your dad stole the sword. But your dad killed my dad. Your dad killed my dad too. Please help me this time. If I survive, I'll write a letter of introduction so you can enter Grailwood Village. Sir Percy is stationed there. He might have some information about your father. Just like I said, I trust my dad. But now that's interesting. Where can I find the centaurs? Oh wait, hold on. Just like I said, I trust my dad. But now that's interesting. Where can I find the centaurs? They usually come to this forest to catch fire butterflies. Lancelot, try looking around. There's a good chance there are a few guys here. Hurry, I'm running out of time. Okay, we got a rescue K. Yeah, there's a centaur. Greetings, beautiful centaur. I am Lancelot, a knight on a quest of utmost urgency. I have heard of your wisdom and abilities, and I come to you seeking your aid. Greetings, Sir Lancelot. I am Chiron, one of the guardians of the forest. How may I be of service to you on this day? My old friend Kay has been bitten by an... I cannot say that word, Anadraga. By an Anadraga, and he is nearing the brink of death. I have heard you possess the knowledge to save him. Ah, I see. The Anadraga is a perilous creature, and its venom is deadly. I can indeed save your friend, but my price is a demanding one. I am a centaur, so my sexual needs are very high, and I couldn't find a female centaur today. You are a beautiful male human. I want to breed with you. Are you prepared to accept this condition? I've always wanted the chance to have fun with a centaur guy. Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh! Lancelot, well done. You have proven yourself to be a worthy knight. Thank you, Sharon. I'm honored. Now, to create the antidote of um, Anadraga, you will need seven tails of death and three heads of life. Seven tails of death, three heads of life? What are those? The tails of death are venomous stingers of those wa of those watchers of the underworld. The heads of life are drops of semen. Oh my. I have created two magical arrows for you. These arrows will guide you to the right places. Thank you, Chiron. I will try. Go now, and may the gods be with you. Sword. <laughs> yeah, when that sword, if they like filled up, it's like if I didn't work, I shouldn't have worked them out. Impressive, Lancelot. You've managed to secure the elusive ingredients. Here, take the antidote crafted from the seven tails of the Watcher and the three seeds of life. Swiftly now, administer it to Kay, for time is of the essence. May it heal him and bring an end to the Venom's grasp. Lancelot, once the crisis is past, let us fuck again. We can share the tales of our adventures and perhaps find joy in the simpler pleasures of the forest. Until then, safe travels, hot night. Lord Jesus. Hey, I've returned with the antidote. There is a crucial step. I need to infuse a seed of life into your system for the remedy to take effect. What the fuck is seed of life? 
Long story short, my semen. <laughs> okay, I see what's coming. No fucking way. I'd rather die, Lance. Fine, see you in, an see in another life, little brat. Hey, wait. All right, do what you must, Lance. But this better work, or I'ma kill you. <laughs> How can you kill me if you're dead? Now swallow the detoxilix. Embrace yourself. This is the final step to vanquish the venom and bring you back to health. But you have to... But you have to do something to warm me up first, don't you think? I'm feeling better, thank you. This Lance is your golden ticket, the key to Grailwood. They're not too fond of uninvited guests, but with this, consider yourself an honored VIP. All right, we got the scroll. Okay, the infusion is complete. You should start feeling relief soon. That fuck was just a bit of theatrics, you know? The seed of life is already in the antidote, haha. <laughs> What? So you're telling me I didn't need that ridiculous fuck? You had me thinking it was some ancient remedy. Well, technically it wasn't necessary. The seed of life and the antidote was the real hero here. You're enjoying this, aren't you? Making a fool out of me during a life or death situation. I should have known better than to trust your fancy nightly tricks, Lancelot. Mark my words, there will be payback for this. You won't escape unscathed from making me the fool in your little drama. Feeling much better now, thanks to the antidote. It's time to head back to Camelot and give Arthur a piece of my mind. And you, Lancelot, get ready for a showdown. The two of us are going to show you what the round table is made of. Lordy, Lord, Lord. Okay. Let's go to town. Welcome to Grailwood. Your introduction has been verified. Enjoy your stay and abide by our village rules. Wow, we've made it to the village. Okay, guys, that's going to end this playthrough. Tune in next time and see what we're going to do in this mysterious village. Hi, guys. Thanks for making it through to the end. Be sure to like and leave a comment, and even subscribe if you aren't already. And be sure to share the video with your friends, too. Until next time.